to maximize quality of production of files, flasks, and potions in War Within Alchemy, you need to strategically allocate your knowledge points into various specializations to enhance your crafting abilities. The goal is to improve your crafting skill, which affects the quality of items, and to increase your multi-craft chances to maximize the number of items produced per crafting action. Step 1. Initial focus on flasks and and file crafting. Starting with zero knowledge points, our primary focus is to enhance the crafting of flasks and files, which will increase both the quality and quantity of crafted items. This requires a specialization in fantastic flasks, allocate points to fantastic flasks, totaling in 30 points. Rank 1 to 30 in fantastic flasks. This specialization improves your ability to craft flasks of various types by granting plus two skill points per allocated knowledge point. By fully investing in this specialization, 30 points, you gain a total of 60 skill which significantly increases your quality of your crafted flasks. Progress to bulk production, flasks and files in the sub-specialization, five points total. Rank one through five in bulk production, invest the next five points in bulk production which improves your ability to craft flasks and files in bulk, gaining plus 3 multicraft per point. At rank 5, you'll receive a bonus of, of plus 5% effectiveness of resourcefulness when crafting flasks or files. At this stage, you will have a total of 35 points invested with a substantial increase in quality and multi-craft potential for flasks. Advance bulk production to rank 10, an additional 5 points by going to rank 6 through 10 in bulk production once again, further increasing your multi-craft by adding 5 more points to reach rank 10 in bulk production. This will enhance your multi-craft capabilities, allowing you to create flasks and files in larger quantities. Moving on to step 2, enhance file production. Allocate points to profession files, 25 points in total, through ranks 1 through 25 in profession files. After maximizing your flask production, invest 25 points into profession file sub-specialization. Each point grants plus 2 skill per point. When crafting files by investing the full 25 points, you gain a total of plus 50 skill to file crafting, enhancing your quality of your files. At rank 20, you'll receive a major bonus of plus 15 multi-craft when crafting files, greatly increasing the number of files you produce. Moving on to step 3, developing potion crafting for quality and multi-craft. Allocate points to potent potions, a total of 30 points as a whole. Rank 1 through 30 in potent potions, invest 30 points into potent potions, special which grants plus two skill per point for crafting potions. This will provide a total of plus 60 skill, improving the quality of your crafted potions. Upon unlocking specialization, there is also a chance to retain empty vials when consuming potions, further enhancing cost effectiveness. Enhance potion production with bulk production sub-specialization of a total of 10 points total. Ranks 1 through 10 in bulk production. After maximizing potent potions, invest 10 points into bulk production. Each point provides plus 3 multi-craft when crafting potions. At rank 5, you'll receive the potion spillover buff, granting plus 12 multi-craft for subsequent potion crafts within 5 minutes, stacking up to 5 times. This further enhances your multi-craft potential for potions. Moving over towards step 4, further optimize your thaumaturgy brackets, your transmutations, for material efficiency. Allocate points to thaumaturgy at 10 points in total. Rank 1 through 10 in this and then invest 10 points to increase your understanding of transmutations, gaining plus 1 skill per point. This will help you gain access to additional sub-specializations that can increase material efficiency and skill. Then invest in gleaming transmutagen and transmutation specializations. 20 points total with a rank 1 through 10 in gleaming transmutagen 
weapon improves overall skill in the transmutation craft and grants you additional materials from transmutations. Rank 1 through 10 in just straight up transmutation. Increase your maximum transmutation charges which ha can help you get more materials over time. This indirectly enhances your crafting efficiency. A summary of point allocation. Fantastic flasks 30 points. Bulk production 10 points. Profession files 25 points. Potent potions 30 points. Bulk production 10 points. Thermaturgy, 10 points, not too sure if I'm saying that right. Gleaming Transmutagen and Transmutation Specializations at 20 points. A total of 135 points in total of knowledge points. To quickly gain necessary knowledge points, craft new recipes as soon as they become available, complete special crafting orders in Dernogal whenever possible, and participate in alchemical events or daily tasks that reward knowledge points. I've also done Done another guide on knowledge points as a whole which was a complete deep dive into this if you need more. Let's detail the profession tools and accessories you should use now. These tools and accessories will directly impact your crafting quality, multi-craft potential and efficiency. By carefully selecting the right equipment you can significantly boost alchemy performance and ensure the best outcomes for both quality and production. Profession tools and accessories for alchemy. Your profession tool that I would recommend is, is Hasty Alchemist Mixing Rod, a base level of at least item level 550. Effective options that you can actually pick is plus 200 integrity, increasing the chance of ingenious breakthroughs, allowing you to create higher quality items. You can also use plus 200 crafting speed, which will speed up your crafting process, reducing the time needed to create each item. And plus 200 resourcefulness reduces the amount of materials needed for each craft, increasing efficiency. Additional bonuses that you gain are plus 8 Kaz Algar Alchemy Skill, a direct boost to your alchemy skill, improving the quality of of all crafted items. My recommended choice is plus 200 integrity. This variation is ideal for maximizing the quality of files, flasks, and potions. Higher integrity increases the chance of crafted items at a higher quality level, making it the most beneficial option for achieving consistent high quality outputs. Moving over towards alchemy, accessory number one is the apothecary's hat, a base item level of at least 564. The effects of this is around about plus 76 multi-craft increases the chance of creating additional items per crafting action and maximizing production plus 114 integrity further boosts the chance of ingenious breakthroughs enhancing item quality and a plus 5 kazalgar alchemy skill provides an additional skill boost contributing to a higher quality outcomes reasons for selection the apothecary's cap offers a strong balance between multi-craft and ingenuity, allowing you to both maximize the number of items produced and enhance their quality. This makes it a versatile choice for any alchemist looking to optimize both aspects simultaneously. For your alchemy accessory number two, the Weather Cloth Alchemist's Robe should be at at least an item level of 551, with the effects of plus 65 resourcefulness, increasing material efficiency by reducing the amount of resources needed per craft lowering costs as well as plus 97 crafting speed improves crafting speed allowing you to produce more items in less time and a plus 5 kazolgar alchemy skill adds a further skill boost enhancing overall quality reasons for selection weaver cloth alchemist's robe provides an essential boost to resourcefulness and crafting speed which are crucial for efficient mass production this accessory ensures you use fewer resources per craft and work faster, aligning perfectly with the goal of maximizing production. Overall equipment strategy. To maximize both the quality and production of files, flasks and potions, the following combination is recommended. Equip the hasty alchemist mixing rod with plus 200 ingenuity to maximize item quality and gain significant alchemy skill boost. Equip then the apothecary's cap to enhance 
enhance your multi-craft and ingenuity once again, providing the best balance between quality and quantity. And then equip the Weaver Cloth Alchemist's robe to further improve your resourcefulness and crafting speed, supporting efficient production and faster crafting. A summary of benefits for this is quality boosts with the combined ingenuity boosts from the Hastily Alchemist's Mixing Rod plus 200 and the Apothecary's Cap plus 114, you maximize your chances of crafting items at the highest possible quality. Production boosts, on the other hand, Apothecary's Cap plus 76 Multicraft and Weaver Cloth Alchemist Robe with Resourcefulness plus 65 and night plus 97 crafting speed work together to increase the number of items produced, use materials efficiently and reduce crafting time. By following this equipment strategy you will align perfectly with the goal outlined in the original parts of this video, ensuring you achieve both high quality and maximum production in your alchemy endeavours. By following this guide and focusing on these point allocations and profession tools and accessories you will maximise both the quality and production of vials, flasks and potions in the War Within Alchemy, leading to a highly efficient and productive crafting path. And this is the guide that I'm going to be using moving forward with everything to do with alchemy. Other than that, have an awesome rest of your day and I shall see you in the next video which will be soon. Mm -hmm.